Macrophages populate virtually every organ. The heart is no exception. Several hundred thousand macrophages reside in the murine heart. These cardiac macrophages are very abundant and evenly distributed within the myocardium in close contact with cardiomyocytes. Cardiomyocytes are subjected to extreme energetic demands and are therefore fully packed with mitochondria to produce high-energy phosphates. Eventually, these and other organelles get worn out and need to be disposed of and replaced. The damaged material is typically degraded inside the cell through the process of autophagy. We show that a large fraction of this damaged material is not recycled within the cardiomyocytes, but rather expelled via particles called exophers. These exophers are formed using the autophagy machinery of the cardiomyocyte. Cardiac exophers expose phosphatidylserine in their membranes, which is recognized by macrophages through the phagocytic receptor MRTK, allowing exopher uptake. When cardiac macrophages internalize exophers, their content is rapidly degraded. This intercellular exchange of material occurs in the heart during homeostasis, although it accelerates in conditions of stress. When cardiac macrophages or MRTK are depleted in the murine heart, Exopher elimination is inefficient and mitochondria accumulate in the extracellular milieu. This causes inflammasome activation and blockage of autophagy in cardiomyocytes, thus preventing the formation of new exophers. In this scenario, cardiomyocytes accumulate dysfunctional mitochondria and become metabolically unfit, in turn preventing the normal contractile function of the heart.